know your pigment lines. So if you're working with an iron oxide, you can use a larger needle size and you have to actually get more ink in. So if I'm putting four layers into the skin, these two layers scab off in the healing process. They're gone. Um, so you actually have to put more ink in with an iron oxide and you want to use a larger needle configuration. Otherwise, in a few years, they're going to heal warm, right? But if you use a larger needle configuration with a carbon, now this is a combination, carbon and iron oxide. So this is like in between carbon, permablend is just carbon. Li pigments, this is an iron oxide. This is a hybrid of the two. So still go easy because it does have a carbon. You don't want to put too much ink in. So if I'm using a straight carbon, I'm using like a single needle, three round liner as well little saturation. You're not putting too much in because this will turn gray over time. You don't want to oversaturate. So with this hybrid line, I'm staying super conservative. Um, I'm not oversaturating the brow like I would have to with an iron oxide. Okay, so know your pigments. If you're using something with a carbon in it, don't put too much in the skin. Use a smaller needle configuration. Don't oversaturate. If you're using your iron oxides, you're going to need to oversaturate that a little bit more because you're going to lose a lot of that in the healing process. Okay. Um, so anyways, if you are using this new Tina Davies fade line, shake it carefully, cover, cover this part with your finger. Um, I like to have an electric shaker on hand for this because it was really hard to shake and get it mixed up. And you can see where it settles because you can see like the yellow and the green at the bottom and the reddish color at the top. Um, and definitely have some sort of ink soap on hand to wipe if you're using this. I mean, I feel that same way about permablend, honestly. I don't need ink soap when I'm using iron oxides. And really loved the mask. It worked awesome. I'll post some pictures and a video and check back in four weeks and I'll post her, woo, I'll post her healed for you.